Today I'm going to show you how to convert a Garmin track to a route. Now, a track is sort of like breadcrumbs. As you move around throughout the day, whether it's on foot or whether it's by vehicle, the Garmin GPS, obviously linked to the satellite, will keep track of all of your movements, no matter how large or no matter how small. And I'm going to explain to you now on the computer how to convert those tracks into routes that you can save on your GPS and use at a later date. The program that you're going to need to do this is called Basecamp, Garmin Basecamp, and you can find this program on the Garmin.com website, which I have previously downloaded and installed, and here we go, we're in the Basecamp app right now. As you can see here, it's currently registering and reading my Garmin Nuvi 2595 that I have connected via USB cable to my Mac computer, and as you can see down here, it's showing a few of the the generic waypoints that I've created simply for this uh, demonstration, as well as the active logs that it's kept for me over the last week or so, uh, showing the dates and times of the active logs, the tracks, uh, or breadcrumbs like I've previously explained. Uh, basically what it does is keep track of your activities by using little tiny breadcrumbs. It, it keeps track of the distances and the areas you've gone to. And if you want to then take those tracks during that, let's say you're a hiker or a biker and you went somewhere that you, you went hiking and it kept track of that track log and you want to convert that into a route that you can maybe do on a regular basis. Maybe you thought that was a great hike or a great bike ride and you want to do that every morning for your morning exercise. You can go ahead and turn that into a route. So you go ahead and click here on one of the active logs and you can either you can even oh no we don't want to rename it you can click on one of the active logs and right click on it and it'll give you the option to create a route from a track so we're going to go ahead and click that and what it does is it reads through all the different points that you you know as it saves those breadcrumbs it creates those points and so it'll go ahead and take those breadcrumbs or those points and turn it into a route uh, that that you can then view on this map simply by uh, selecting this drop down menu and select show selected on map and as you can see here on the map it's going to go ahead and take all these active log points from that day September 2nd and as you can see in the orange line here it's taken our points of where we traveled and now created a route as you can see it kind of swirls down here swirls way out here by the Indian Creek Golf Course comes back and heads back towards our home. So there we go that's how you take your tracks and turn it into a route on the Garmin GPS and then how you get it to how you add it to your actual unit is by simply coming up here to the upper left hand corner where it says send list to device. You click on that and it'll ask you right here what do you want to send to your Garmin GPS and obviously you would just select routes. Or you can select those tracks if they're tracks that you have added because you can also add tracks in the program too. But right now you've converted those tracks into a route so we're going to actually select routes and it's going to send that new route that you've just created and you can of course label it whatever you want. Uh, it'll send that to your Garmin GPS. Mm -hmm.